dive into movies and TV series where we make vocabulary, idioms, and grammar unforgettable in minutes. Ready to unlock the cinematic secrets of English? Welcome to Crow English. Madeline, I am a um, great job in there. I think we hooked him. I mean, you really have that chef wrapped around your finger. Wrap someone around your finger to persuade someone easily to do what you want them to do. With her seamless charm and persuasive skills, she could easily wrap someone around her finger. That is so not true. I knew just how special you were, and I was so excited to mentor you and empower you. Empower. To give someone official authority or the freedom to do something. With her charming personality, she could easily wrap people around her finger. And her motivational speeches could empower them to reach their goals. So that you could empower a future generation of women. OMG, it's a hormone tsunami. Tsunami is a huge sea wave caused by a great disturbance under an ocean as a strong earthquake or volcanic eruption. It can also mean that a sudden increase or overwhelming number or volume of something. The demand for the new product was like a tsunami, impossible to wrap around your finger due to its overwhelming volume. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, so proud. <sighs> Girl, you're blown up. Oh, gee, Doug. What? I didn't know you two were in touch. We haven't talked in months. It must be about dial. But dial can be used as a verb or a noun. Being a verb, it means to call someone's phone unintentionally by sitting or pressing on your phone while it is in your pocket. Being a noun, it refers to a phone call that someone makes unintentionally by sitting or pressing on their phone while it is in their pocket. When his phone accidentally made a butt dial, he couldn't help but wonder if it was fate calling for him to reach out to his old girlfriend. Or he realizes what he's let go of just as you're prepping to go back could be fake calling. Prep. To prepare something. Or to prepare yourself or someone else to do something. Fake calling. Is a figurative expression. Often used to suggest that destiny. Or a significant life-changing event is on the horizon. When the opportunity arose, he believed it was fake calling. And he seized it knowing it would empower him to make a difference in the world. It's not. We'll see. Uh, listen, I've got a Zoom meeting and then a doctor's appointment, so you won't see me the rest of the day. I've directed all the French resumes to be sent through to your email, so comb through them and get those interviews. Comb through is a phrasal verb that means to examine or search through something very thoroughly often in a systematic and detailed manner. After he accidentally made a but dial to his boss, he had to comb through his call history and apologize for the unintentional call. Set pronto. Bye. Pronto. Quickly and without delay. I need to comb through these documents pronto to find the important details for the presentation. Madeline, I am um, great job in there. I think we hooked him. I mean, you really got that chef wrapped around your finger. That is so not true. I knew 
just how special you were. And I was so excited to mentor you and empower you so that you could empower a future generation of women. OMG, hormone tsunami. I'm sorry. Uh, so, so proud. Girl, <sighs> really, you're blowing up. OMG, oh, Doug. What? I didn't know you two were in touch. We haven't talked in months. It must be about dial. Or he realizes what he's let go of just as you're prepping to go back. Could be fate calling. It's not. We'll see. Uh, listen, I've got a Zoom meeting and then a doctor's appointment, so you won't see me the rest of the day. I've directed all the French resumes to be sent through to your email, so comb through them and get those interviews set pronto. Bye.